Hey everybody, welcome to Five for a Change. I'm going to teach you how to make this LED light. Right here, what's going to happen is I'm going to round off the corners. Now this is just a piece of tin and it can be very sharp. So I'm going to fast forward while I round these off. But as you can see, it's got a natural curve to it, which actually works out to our advantage. I tried to flatten it out, but then I was like, no, you know what? We're going to let it curve. What I'm doing here is just measuring out the LED strip. This is cuttable, so you can cut it at certain points and it'll still work. It's got little tabs on it that you can solder on extra wires if you want to make it any certain length. Right here, I'm just getting my measurements. Okay, now that I've got my measurements, I'm going to go ahead and cut this. You're able to cut it right where it has a little scissors mark. The back of these are actually sticky, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick it down and put it to the natural curve of the tin layout. What I'm doing here is cutting off the waterproofing that exposes the connection so I can connect the wires onto the next one. What I did here was cut the wire that was already pre-attached to it. It had a connector, so I took the wire off, and now we're going to wire this up. And what we're using is 22 gauge solid wire for the connections. Once we've got our wires taped down to the appropriate positive and negative, we go ahead and solder them down. Once you got them soldered down, you just repeat the steps for the other end, but always make sure that you're running positive with positive and negative with negative. You can see that I went ahead and connected them all, and I put a 9 volt battery to it, which makes it light up super easy and almost done. I skipped ahead a little bit and I didn't film this part, but what I did was I put a little switch into this equation and also I added a connector for the nine volt battery just to plug onto so you're not trying to wrap wires onto it. But this is the end result. I also put a little bit of hot glue to hold the LEDs on along with the wires. And there you go, you got a LED light. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. It's a quick little project that you can do. It doesn't cost very much money. I put it together in about 45 minutes and I really had never done it before. So right there you have an instant light, maybe for emergencies, runs off a nine volt battery, real easy to do. Don't forget if you're watching on YouTube to like, subscribe, and also let all your friends know about it. You can find us on social media also. We have a social site, kind of like Facebook where you can go on, create a profile, share all the cool things that you're doing also to make a change. Thanks for watching.